They say a team is like a family. But for DU Women's Lacrosse, three families make up their team. The DeRoses, a set of triplets, then two sets of twins, the Colomores and the Palmasanos. I feel like it's so awesome to come in with like your built-in best friend and like it's just so much comfort and like it makes the transition so much easier. Growing up we've always been super competitive with each other so it's kind of fun to be able to still compete and be with each other on the field. Even just traveling knowing like you'll have someone there to like can you save me sit on the plane or like I don't know <laughs> like dumb stuff like that. And it's just so good to have someone on the team that you care about and we all like kind of get that thing. I feel like no one else really gets that mm -hmm. special thing that I think we only get. <laughs> There's no doubt a lot of sisterly love, but... <laughs> there, there's bickering. <laughs> Everyone, whenever they're around it, thinks it's the funniest thing ever, so it's never anything serious. Yeah. Everyone just laughs. And apparently, <laughs> twin telepathy crosses families. She's oldest, I'm middle, and Taylor is the youngest. I would guess that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. No, I don't really think that any team has, you know, like multiple sets of twins or triplets on it. Yeah. Our team is like such a family and I think that, you know, having twins and triplets already family members just like promotes the culture even more. And on this type of team, Hi. there's sometimes confusion. Sometimes I'll like answer to like Kayla or Gracie, so like it's just a little like funny and weird at the same time if somebody just throws out a name and I'll just turn and look and be like, oh, that's not me. But. I think it's absolutely yeah. amazing. I think we talk about, you know, leaving a legacy, but it's not just our own. It's like the three of ours. It's all the sisters that are involved. I, I kind of look at it as more like a selfless thing. At DU, Jacob Toby, 9 News.